The luxurious world of shiny legendary Pokemon. Mewtwo's green tail and white body look really cool, but at the same time, remember Shadow Mewtwo? Yeah, that would have been a pretty cool shiny. Latios' rich mint color is phenomenal. Spectrier gets a really cool maroon, but unfortunately, Glastrier wasn't nearly as lucky. The Lake Trio gets gold bodies with darker head colors. Rizion's pink color is beautiful, but Iron Leaves is a paradox Pokemon, so... Come on. Dialga's more teal color looks really nice, and its origin form makes it even more vibrant. Giratina's shiny is really bright and beautiful considering it's, you know, the lord of the distortion world. Now, Palkia wasn't nearly as lucky. I shiny hunted one of these guys. Never again. Necrozma gets a really nice navy. Not really fitting its concept, but I mean, it looks cool. Entei and Raikou get overall darker, while Suicune as well as Walking Wake get glorious cold color schemes. Plus, I will never unsee Walking Wake having a Glimora on its neck. Shin Pao's brown might be a turnoff for some, but I kind of like it. Now, how could we forget about Rayquaza? Oh boy, in its mega form. Oh, those orange accents are beautiful. I would marry the shiny if I could. 